Hey guys, it's Saturday. It's already one o'clock. <laughs> I let myself sleep in, which is nice. Well, I was up at eight. I was gonna sleep in later than that because we went to bed so late, but I had an alarm go off at eight that I forgot was set to go off every day because I get up either at seven or 7.30 now, but I have this eight o'clock alarm as a backup, which I haven't used. Usually I'm like working at my computer when it goes off, I just shut it off. But I forgot I had that and it woke me up this morning and then I couldn't fall back asleep. <laughs> So I was on my phone for quite a while just relaxing in bed and I felt so good when I woke up like I've never felt this good after a night of drinking I was like woo, I'm on top of the world <laughs> And then eventually I kind of fell back asleep for a while. So That's how my morning's been YouTube videos and going back to sleep and I got the vlog up just now and Replied to a bunch of emails because I haven't replied to emails all week And so I finally caught up on all of that. I'm like yes Feels so good to get that done because I neglect my emails all the time. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get in a bit of a workout, maybe DDR. It's been a while since I've done DDR. I've been doing mostly elliptical, so maybe I'll do a bit of DDR. And we need to go pick up Christian's ring because his wedding band came in. Who, oh, baby? What else today? I want to do cleaning, like vacuuming, just clean up the house in general, like my mess. This room's getting a little messy. It's not the worst. Also, for that Etcher art satchel I got in the mail, I want to watch this video that shows all the features of it. It's over an hour long, and so I'm going to just sit down, watch that, and kind of follow along and test out all the different ways you can configure this bag and everything, just so I'm prepared to use it, because I want to start using it this week. I don't know if I'm really going to get out of the house to use it or just using it here, but we'll see because i'm planning on that video going up on august 20th which is a sunday and so i need i need to use i need to start using it <laughs> and then the last thing i need to do is just final prep for my youtube stream that's going to be going on tomorrow morning at 10. so i just need to like i i haven't streamed on youtube in so long aside from that mobile stream so i need to make sure my setup is all good on the computer to go live i think there's going to be some trial and error in the morning but I want to be mostly prepared, so that's my plan for today. As for an eye update, it doesn't feel much different than it did before I went to bed because most of the pain happened when the actual punch happened and then within five minutes most of the pain was gone other than like a bit of soreness here and my eye feeling like there's a hair in it. And so right now I still have some of that soreness and that hair in the eye feeling, but other than that it's all good. But I think it's a little less painful than when I went to bed, I'm not sure. TDR's kicking my butt. And yes, I slept in the shirt I wore yesterday. Ha <laughs> ha. <sighs> dying in my throat. Dying water doesn't help. New record though in love is dreaminess, yeah. Although that's actually kind of surprising because it's only an 8.8, .8, but yeah, I'll take it. <sighs> you wanna play now, Kiki? Okay, here we go. She's like, nah, man. <sighs> my specialty is lounging. Like me now. Oh, well, now you wanna play, okay. Accepted my taunt. Here we go, Kiki. Want an easy one? Here you go. Flow on basic. Knock him dead, Kiki. Grab the fruit of tomorrow. Oh. There's always a tomorrow. Yeah, Kiki. It's Mina's turn. Oh, she's pushing buttons already. Mina, your bum is. I'm trying to press X, but it's she's pressing the top arrow. Sorry, baby. Baby. Oh, oh, what did you just pick? What difficulty did you just pick? Difficult. It's doable. I just usually play basic just because it's fun. It's a really great warm-up song or like a cool-down song. I can't hit the up arrows, baby! <laughs> now, okay, now she spooked and ran off. <laughs> Gotta save this. Drop the beat. Nando's, Nando's, Nando's chicken. We decided to just grab food because we were out picking up Christian's ring. It was under my name, so I had to go. Well, I mean, they didn't ID me. Maybe he could have gone, but they had been like, you're not Bailey. <laughs> uh, it took quite a while. It took, we waited almost half an hour before they could help us because they were so busy. So 
yeah, but now we're back and we have food and we're just gonna watch some YouTube videos and then after that I'm gonna get started on my vacuuming and stuff. So I've been cleaning up. I'm not fully done, but just getting stuff off the floor at least. A little bit. <laughs> Slowly. I vacuumed upstairs already, but the vacuum died and so it's been recharging. It might be good to use. I might wait a little bit longer. I'll just do some prep for the live stream. I doubled up my books down here so that I could fit more on this shelf because I've been putting stuff outside the room on that black shelf right there. And I'm going to keep some of that stuff there like my Imagine FX magazines. There's other magazines and books but for art books I'm gonna keep them all here and then they're all just in one spot easier to grab especially if I'm sitting over here sketching which right now I'm not I was just finalizing my idea for the live stream tomorrow and now the vacuum should be fully charged so I can tackle the basement including getting in all the nooks and crannies in my art room where there's a bunch of spiders just lurking they're so skinny you gotta look close to see them for example there's one right there but he's a skinny little bugger so they're hard to detect they're all over the place there's quite a few i can spot around here and there's one right down there in the crack time to suck them all up in the vacuum yeah they're not gonna stand a chance so this blister on my thumb knuckle here it was kind of there all week and i was wondering where the heck it was from like what caused it and then I was using the vacuum today and it rubbed it even more to the point where the skin is peeling. And I was like, oh my God, it's the vacuum that does it to me. Apparently, just the way the handle is, it rubs right here, I guess. I've never had that before though. But mystery solved. I'm now sitting in bed. <laughs> I'm about to watch the video for this. It's actually only 40 minutes long. For some reason, I thought it was just over an hour long, but that's not too bad at all. And it's just going to go through all the features of it. So I have the actual bag here and then the pencil case here. So I'm just going to kind of follow along and do what he does in the video just to learn all the features. Because this thing is so hecka detailed. There's like that. There's all these straps and things. This unzips. You got a pouch here. You got pouches here. And this is so bungee. This feels nice. Velcro. Ooh, yeah, a little zipper pouch here. Yeah, baby. You got this. You got this. Look at that rugged texture. Whoa. You got a zipper pouch on the front. Over here, you got all these doohickeys. Whoa. And then this is a pouch back here. These are also Velcro. Everything's movable. Then there's this zipper pouch, which, spoiler alert, is also Velcro. Huh. Like what are these? Some straps. Yeah. So many things. Then you got this back piece. This is for mounting to a tripod. These are backpack straps which are removable. Oh man. Oh man, I can't wait to dive into this video. <laughs> this is all weather resistant too. So if it's rainy and you're carrying your stuff around, you're not gonna ruin your art. Winning. We got a pouch here. This opens up all kinds of things to hold your pencils and crap that you bring with you. Oh, oh yes. Oh yes. Much hype. Along the sides, you can see these two loops. Yeah. So these will basically just straight on. Oh, I'm missing my strap. I put it somewhere. I think it's downstairs. I have a strap for this. You can wear it like a purse. <gasps> yeah. Like a mini satchel. Over the shoulder. Get through the gates. I would just scan this, just hold it up to the scanner, and um, away. So the material itself is a little bit stretchy, so you can actually pack it out and squeeze it shut and pull it closed. Okay, so in here, I'll just quickly run through what we've got. We've got these long pockets here. I need a smaller sketchbook or notebook that'll fit in here. I have some that are smaller than this, but they're really thick and they're still too wide. 
I could make one. I could make a little one. Oh my god. These unclip and clip into each other so you can make one long strap. Oh. Oh. I'm getting close to being done the video and I am shooketh. I'm taking notes. Oh. Hi. Look at this. My phone is strapped in there. That's <laughs> yeah, really in there. Good. And then I can strap in like a sketchbook or something. I mean, this might work better with one that has a coil spine or something. Well, no, because there's enough space for me to open it up fully like this. I feel like I'm spoiling a lot in the vlog, but <laughs> this you could like rip off and put it on the other side of the bag if you want. I didn't even realize at first that you can take off this side too. Like, look at it. You could pull it off. It's loose because I was already playing with it. I didn't stick it back down all the way, but you could just peel this off and put it on the other side of the bag if you want. Make it how you want. And there's so many other useful little hooks and things. I'm just I'm shook it. There, look at that. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Oh, why, hello there. It's it's just me. I'm just it's just about to start some sketching here. Look, I can just wear this like this oh my oh oh dear i can stand and draw stuff anyway i just made it through the video and i'm super pumped to actually start using this i don't know how much i'll get to use it outside of the house before i make the video because it's gonna be like first impressions and then i can use it in other videos going forward or something but i'm so hyped i'm more hyped than i was before because there's so much more functionality than i thought there was Dude, dude, dude. Oh, baby, what you got there? Are you laying on it? <laughs> I realized that I hadn't seen Midna fetch a lot recently, and I was like, well, maybe she doesn't have her toy. She throws it under the table. Oh, is it underneath there? Yeah. Anyway, so I went on the hunt for it. Oh, she can't reach that. That's too far. <laughs> there, you want this? You want Daddy to throw it? But yeah, I was like, I haven't seen her play fetch with Christian in a long time. So I was like, wait, it's because that toy hasn't been around. So I went on a hunt for it. It was under this couch. And she got so excited when I took it out. She was so hype. Happy. Hypey. Yeah, that's true. She was hype. Happy and hype. Ah, my favorite toy is back. But I'm going to go to bed because I have my stream in the morning. So, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Some of us are doing the Meyer Breaks test. <laughs> Disagree. Did we just get the 